are. Welcome back to another episode of Us. <laughs> yes. This is Us. Yeah. Sorry in advance about it, about outside noise. Our microphone isn't the best, and it's super hot in here, so, like, the door's open. And we're not going to close it, because reasons. <laughs> Um, so hey, I just recently got into Lore Olympus, and I'm like... What is that? It's a webtoon, webcomic. Oh, Lore Olympus. Yeah. Of course, Lore Olympus. Yeah. I know Lore Olympus. I know you do. When you say it quick like that, it sounds like it's something more than it is. Oh. Like, it sounds like... No, not you. Lore Olympus. Yeah. It sounds like, hello, nice to meet you. I'm Lore Olympus. <laughs> yeah. Lore Olympus. And holy balls, is it amazing. Oh yeah, it's really good. Yeah. Like, if you're into Greek mythology at all, you need to read this. <laughs> That's really pretty. Yeah, it's something new to go there. Yeah. Um, but I, I really enjoy the... I, I really enjoy modern tellings of things in general. But like I've been, I've been a Greek lore geek for pretty much my whole life, so like reading this has been a trip and a treat. Yeah, it's a super good series. Yeah. It's on webtoons, if as she mentioned. Uh huh. So I highly recommend anyone to look it up and take a read. Because it is super good. It's like a, it's like a modern retelling of some classic uh, Greek myth tales. Yeah, uh, it, it's almost like a modern retelling of um, the Odyssey. Almost. Odyssey. Yeah. I mean, Persephone is one of the main characters. Yeah. And she is no part in the Odyssey. No, well, that's true. I don't know if I would say it's the Odyssey. Necessarily. That is a dark blue. It's a bedroom. I know, but that is a dark blue even for a bedroom. Oh, we got an accent wall. You almost made it. Hey, look, Ma, you almost made it. <laughs> Actually, let's keep these. It was handy to have the uh, extra. That's <laughs> uh, probably a better place for them anyway. So we need for another room. <sighs> okay, first of all, goodbye. Do not need that. You weird housemakers who had freaking things to everything. Uh, why are those not on? Are they on? Guess they are. They don't look on. I think they, I think we should replace them. I don't know if we replaced those already. I don't either. But let's worry about the bedroom. Okay. Obviously, the main thing to any bedroom is a bed. Is a bed. Whoa! Let's see if I just search bed. No, of course not. This place is so bad at organizing their shit. Uh, furniture, furniture, bed. There we go. Ouch. Like I get that that worked, but if I search bed, it should come up with every bed. Yeah. Whatever. Okay. Well, this is a house for what? A couple. It's too big for one person, generally speaking. Mm -hmm. Like that giant kitchen, I feel like it's got to be at least two. And since there's only one bedroom, mm -hmm. it's got to be for a couple, right? Right. So we, we need a bed big enough for two. Ooh, I like the teddy. Teddy? Uh-huh. I believe that's sitting on the floor. Yeah, well, welcome to Europe. <laughs> oh, oh, no, no it's there not. is a bed. Okay, well, we can do that. Maybe. <laughs> Yeah, I know. That's pretty much the whole room. But then again, any bed this size will be, so. 
that's okay. It's just this room is made for sleeping and nothing else. <laughs> and because this is Europe, unfortunately, it also means we need a wardrobe. I mean, we could make the we could take out the wall and make the room bigger. What? You'd want the bed to the garage to to get to the no, garage. No, no, no. To... Into you can make it into the living room a little more. Do we have a bathroom no. in this? Yes. Okay. That blocks the. Right. Yeah, this is, we cannot. You'd do have that. to take the bathroom out to the. Yeah, it doesn't work. Room. So. Nope. Uh, bed, desk, sofa, table. I guess cupboards. Is that where? Yeah, that's where the wardrobe is. Okay. Um. Stylish. Well, we could go with that first one. It looks nice. Oh, some of these are nice too. Chest of drawers, Mel. <laughs> Look. It does say that. Yep. <laughs> well, this is Europe. <laughs> and unfortunately, there's nothing in nature that sprays your bum with water. That's true. So, that little round cabinet is cute. I want to use it for something, but I don't know what. Hmm. We need a wardrobe. There's yep. this one that I was looking at. Sure. Uh, well, I was, I was giving options. Oh. Looks like this one is a little lighter. Ooh. And let's see, that one's a little. Uh, then there's this one. I actually like that top one. This one? Yeah. It was between that one and the one directly below it. Okay, well. This is kind of a dark color, mm -hmm. which I think works for it anyway. Okay. And yeah, that color actually kind of works. Okay. I feel like we need like a bedside table. Yeah, but where are you going to put it? On the bedside? Come on, Mr. Keep Up. There's no room on the bedside. You're no room on the bedside. Uh, oh my god. There's a tiny little square of space. Does that work, though? I, I, Would you rather look at other nice dance? I guess that works. That doesn't sound like a yes. <sighs> do you want to keep looking, or do you want to buy this one? Just yeah, it's fine. For fuck's sake. Do you like it or not? Look at what else is there. Not very wow, much. Wow, there's really not much. I guess probably the smallest one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, there we go. It is a t it is a stool. Yeah, but there's no other nightstand that's small enough, so it has to be that. Uh, decorations. Man, where would... And also, Mel, no, it's not a fucking stool. It's a stool. Well, I mean, it's in a bedroom, so you know. and stuff. That's interesting. What are you aiming to put in here? A clock or something? Oh. Uh, fireplace. Oh, there's fireplaces. I mean, I would. There's a clock. Oh, sorry. I meant like a, night, a bedside clock. Oh. I I no. would just search like for that? a clock. Yeah, like an alarm clock, like that. <clears throat> but I don't trust this game to show me all the clocks if I search clock. It'll show you a dildo. That's a weird place to jump. <laughs> not for me. It's not. Oh, god, damn it! It's a stool. It doesn't. 
I don't honestly think it would matter. But it does. It looks like nothing goes on those. But you could you could put it on the on the uh, windowsill. It looked like. But that's dumb. Why would I want to do that? Because at least then there's an alarm clock. It doesn't have to be. People will buy it anyway. <laughs> okay, see that one looks like it works in a, in a bedroom. I put it on the other wall, the white wall. Yeah. Okay, now it's just floating in space. True. This wall's more contained. You cannot contain the artwork. That's right. Yeah, I keep... Kitchen. That's, uh... Incredibly tiny. Yep. That's pretty big. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. These are actually not too bad. Oh. We haven't done the bathroom yet. Yeah, that's true. I didn't realize it had uh, not happened yet. That's neat. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, light. Lamp. Ceiling. Um. Some super fancy chandelier. Yeah. Like that? Sure. Perfect. Right there. Terrible place for a light switch. Yeah, why would it be behind the door? I have no idea. Somebody didn't know what they were doing. Uh, it would be in installations. That's right, it would. Standard light switch. Oh, so we don't get the fancy one. That's the side of the door it should be on. Okay, I think that's pretty much all you need in here. Yeah. It's just a bedroom. Okay, uh, we need to do this stuff later, but I think bathroom is necessary now. Yes. Okay, uh, shower. Light switch needs to be replaced. Yeah, that's a terrible place for a light switch. Why are they putting light switches in terrible places? Because they're European. Everything's backwards. Okay, radiator. Wait, no, that's Japanese. Bye bye Well, that makes sense, actually. Yeah. Uh, okay, now we need to retile it. Yep. We should make an orange bathroom. Everything orange. Orange? Yeah. Okay, why? Because the bedroom's blue, the kitchen and kitchen is copper, the living room is brown. Okay, orange. We just made an orange uh, place the other time. No, that was like oh. orchid. No, we used this. Oh, oh yeah. We were helping someone. Now we can do this maybe on the floor. Uh huh. And then do something a little more muted for the walls. Okay. Oh, this is the walls. I'm gonna see if I can find an example of what I'm thinking uh, about. Well, how about you look through the examples of the ones you see with your eyes right now? No, that's fine at all. Because they're very limited. How about this? This like sepia. For walls? Yeah. It's not bad. Okay, you don't sound excited. I'm wondering there's if there's else someone more even orange. Close to orange. Alright, do you see anything else? That's okay, let's do green instead. Besides the friggin' bright crap there. Well, there's this. Uh huh. There's the big old green ones there. Uh huh. And there's these. I like those there's ones. These. Those are what those are what inspired me. These ones? Uh-huh. We could do those. Yeah. Okay, let's do those then. Tiling. Boop. And boop. That's actually pretty good for a bathroom. If the homeowner is red green colorblind, they'll like this house even more. Also, I really enjoy the uh patterning on on these yeah these are great yeah i'm a little worried about them at first 
because I had no idea what they really looked like on a wall. They don't really give a good preview of that. Right. But, yeah, these look great. I kind of think for the floor we should do something a little bit more neutral. Nah, make it lime green. Yeah, well, see, the walls are already so green. Mm hmm. So, the floor should be something more neutral. No! Click that every time. At least with painting, you only have to do it every once in a while. Yeah. Oh, interesting. So I'm looking at green bathroom ideas and on Pinterest, and there's this one that has like a shiny green tile floor and stark white walls. Yeah, that's because you can't make everything bright green. I, I know. You have to do something different on the floor. Floor tiles. Are there like subway tiles? What does that mean? Subway tiles are the long rectangular ones. Maybe for the f ground. No. Yes. No. Yes. Which one is it? Yes. Yes. These are the longest ones. See how that looks. Unfortunately, this isn't really something we can preview super well. There, no, there's your preview. Okay. That's perfect, actually. Well, that worked out then. Yeah. Okay. Um, since we're here, let's do... Do I want to do halogen? I think I do. And then we need a mirror with lights above it. Wow, it's like a super spotlight. Yeah. It's not what I wanted, but... There's no good ceiling light that I like. Oh look, Lil Wayne fan is here. Oh, hello. We could do the ceiling light li line. Uh, we could also do this rectangular lamp. I like that one better. Okay. I don't like the color options, though. Yeah, black isn't bad, I guess. Okay, that works. Much better. Wow, that looks nicer. Okay, first things first. Toilette. Well, now, now you don't have to worry about it, because we went with a different... What? 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 Uh, what? I... I feel... I feel... Violated. It's from the Valentine's section. My bottom feels violated. <laughs> Uh, let's just buy the normal kind. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm good with that. Yep, me too. Eventually we'll make a love hotel. When we do, we'll use that. Good. My bottom <sighs> feels violated. And while we're here, violating bottoms. <laughs> uh, let's see, most people are right-handed, so over there on the right. No, that means on the left side. So you reach over for it. Yeah. Yeah. 
had to act yeah. it out, do some charades to... I uh, noticed that. Yeah. <laughs> so apparently they added a different shower. Ooh. I like the corner showers. Yeah. Do that one. This one? Yeah. Oh. White glass, blue glass, darkened Black glass. glass. Do you want the darkened glass? Yeah. It like cuts into the door frame, but whatever. That was a way easier installation. Yeah, it was. And yeah, that doesn't matter. Apparently. Can't go in. Oh. Sad. Okay, now we need the mirror. It's okay, we don't need a shower. Mirror. Um. Lamont. Yeah, I think it's just like a thinner frame. Oh. And here we got like a mirror with a light on it. It looks like. I don't know. Which one do you like? Uh. The one on the bottom left. Yeah, that's fine. I will go with the wedge to kind of match the everything else we got going. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, cool. We are vampire. Wait a minute. No. Seeing if there was like a medicine cabinet or something. That'd be nice. Wait, what's this? Washer. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Mountable washer. I was wondering about all the extra room. And I didn't even think about it, but yeah, there's not really a, uh... <laughs> Where we're going, we don't need no showers. <laughs> yeah, there's not really a place for it otherwise. Yeah. Unless you count the, the wet room. Um, I know a lot of people... would be a good place for it, but... I know a lot of people who have their washer and dryer in the garage. That would make sense. Yep. I was thinking, you know, since there is a, uh, a mud room... That's what it's called, mudroom. Uh -huh. That would have made the sense to put it in there. Yeah. And they got a very perfectly functional little area here. They could have put the washer dryer in here. Uh -huh. Yeah, we don't need all those all those shelves. We don't even need a dryer, apparently. Apparently not. Because we're in Europe now. We hang dry shit. <sighs> yeah, I mean, oddly. Because you know. Oh. Okay, well that's uh, gone. Do you know what color that was? Uh, white. Think. It'd be nice if you could check it. Yeah, it would. There's one more thing they never thought of. Light cream? Light cream sounds right. You think? Yeah. Okay. Looks right, too. Nice. That's so much better. Okay. Um, now we just need to deal with the garage. But I think we should do a task. We only have two. Yeah. We might be uh, slowly running out. What? Okay. We bought a house with a hidden war bunker. Post-war bunker. Previous owner didn't appreciate what we had and we made had. it a storage room. We care about safety. The weather's part of the country gives us some concern. We have renovated the house, but as for the bunker, we want it done by a professional. Can we count on you equipping it properly? If a tornado or something worse would hit, we want a safe place where we can go for several weeks to be safe. Okay. Sure. I love flowers, unlike people. Uh, is, uh, is she saying she doesn't like people, or that people don't like flowers? I think she's saying a combination of the two things. Well, I bet she's fun at parties. It's a bunker. It's going to be outside. Who knows? Um, I know. Thief bunker. Archie yeah, bunker. your face is a bunker. Um, I don't think that's how that works. Okay. 
So just like any good bunker, when you first enter it, you enter into the bathroom. Yeah, makes all the sense. Remove object, cigarette self. Mounting toilets. And how does that make you feel? Mm-hmm. <laughs> water heater. What the huh. hell kind of water heater is this? One that goes on the wall, apparently. It's a European water he heater. This is the one that they wanted. You know, we already bought it, whatever, just leave it. Chest of drawers, Mal. <laughs> Mini chest of drawers, Mal. Okay. Here. Clip in the wall, there you go. Toilet paper holder. Toilet paper holder. Bam, we already determined. Actually, in this case, probably like this. Three times toilet paper. Okay. Wait, four times, my mistake. One. Forgot to click the buy mini. Okay, and lay ceramic tiles. Okay, ceramic tiles, gray square on the wall. Crap on the wall. Ow, 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 random headache. Ooh, no. Go away. <gasps> Wanna put it in a place where you're where you'll actually Look at it sometimes. Sometimes. Clearly. That's all I can ask. Uh, this upgrade cannot come soon enough. I don't know what the upgrade will have, but anything to make this process less painful would be acceptable. It's definitely your chest of drawers, Mal. It's got your name on it and everything. is insistent that they're not his drawers. Oh, well. Some people just don't want to admit their own identity. What? Mal is a chest of drawers. I identify as a wardrobe, I guess. <laughs> Dang it, almost. So close. We're gonna have way too many now. Yeah, but you can sell them back. Maybe. I haven't actually checked if I can. Oh yeah, I sold something over here before. Wait a minute. I just did that whole thing. 
Yeah. I'm at zero percent. Ceramic tiles, gray squares. Squares plural. I needed square singular. Oh no. This one. Oh. Everyone's favorite part, tiling, is now going to continue. Ugh. Well, your percentage is going up, so that's how you know it's working. Yep. You got the right one this time. <laughs> more nothing, experience? Nothing makes you hate a mechanic in a game more than having to do it twice. Well, if you did it right the first time... New skill point! Oh, thank God. Please be... I guess I have to do this first. Please be something that makes this as for plastering. Please be something that makes this easier. It doesn't seem easier at all. Yeah, having to go back for every single section of wall is really obnoxious. Yeah. It makes me never want to use tiles on anything. Ever. Ever. Game designers need to understand realism is not more important than playability or fun. Right. At least they don't make us go back for every single tile and have to do them one at a time. That's true. That's the only way this could be... No, that's not true. There are more ways this could be worse. There are a lot of ways this could be worse. For example... It could make the names of all the different tile sets incredibly similar, so that sometimes <laughs> you pick the wrong one. Brandon, they're European. Seems to be ex an excuse for everything. <laughs> Why did this one take only three stacks? It didn't. Yes, it did. No, you had like one tile left on that stack. And you took, the, like, three okay, off of the other didn't... stack. Oh, fucking whatever. Jeez. There's a sink, right? Yeah. Yeah, sink. Okay, mount will sink. <laughs> you got upgraded to a 10% chance of getting shanked by a hobo. F what? What is what? What does that have to do with anything? <laughs> hey. And Shop. oh crap. Oddly, that part is oddly realistic. Eh, that's fine for now. Oh, I should have picked one of the new showers. Just because they are so much easier to assemble. Too late now. Yep, I did notice that. keep saying this isn't so annoying except for having to click every little thing. If I just had to like click anywhere to have a thing happen, that would be fine. But no, you have to like be super specific. Yeah, because clearly it likes showing us the how things get assembled. Right. And I am not actually against that. It's kind of cool to see how things assemble. Yeah. I'm just against having to click on tiny little screws and get flung around the bathroom every time there's a new piece. Okay, there we go. Oh, 
Okay. Back into the mess. Yep, it was bound to happen. Okay, um, we'll move object shelf. It's gonna help with cleaning. Still says clean dirt. Oh, there we go. Okay, uh, paint with colors white. Certainly adventurous people, these. Sounds like not a great color for a bedroom. But... Yeah, apparently they do want a bed in this room. It's. I. Yep, I know. They're paying us the big bucks to not care that they are wrong about their choice of colors. And room sizing. Well, it is a bunker. It's not supposed to be comfortable. It's supposed to be paranoid. <laughs> okay, it's not required, but... Okay, bed with drawer. Bed with drawer mouth. That bed is an option. Bed with drawer. Oh man, the stark white makes white, so much sense against white, the white wall. White. If they want to go, they're gonna go. They're gonna go. Uh, okay. What? The drawer. <laughs> there you go. They go on both sides. What are you talking about? Oh. Okay, I can see what they're doing here. Oof. Yeah, I really... What the hell is that? Oh, you know what? I think... Oh, no, it doesn't say to remove. Just remove trash. Yeah. And clean dirt. First aid kit. I'll get to buying stuff. Gotta clean first. The less is in my way when I'm cleaning, the better. Got it. Paint with color white. Oh, I already sold it, didn't I? Yep. Oof. <laughs> Why is Mal telling us his bed's a queen? Because I was teasing him about uh, about about the bed. Oh. I, I was saying it's gonna be another Mal. Quit making Mal make non sequiturs. No. That's my job. Aaron Circuiters. Aramagird. This is a pretty good sized bunker. Yeah. It's got a bathroom, a bedroom, a living room, and probably a kitchen. Yeah, kitchen's bound to happen. I'm feeling this one in particular is a storage room. First aid kit. Water container. Yeah, it's a storage room. Okay, water container times five. It's not going to fit on the shelves. Nope. Wow. Of course it wouldn't. Why would it? Food container times four. Let's 
food container. Those sit on the shelf. Yeah. Pickled cucumbers. Pickled cucumbers. <laughs> yes, very fine indeed, Mel. Nuts. Ah, oh, nuts. <laughs> nuts. Jar of soup. Jar. Jar of soup. There it is. Ew, it's tomato soup. Maybe. Or just some other soup that's really bad. Macaroni. You pronounced it wrong. It's macaroni. Okay, and Rise. Oops. Rise. They're not paying you to be pretty about it. Peanut butter, five. I really like peanut butter. It's my favorite thing to eat. But it said five, but I must have misread it. Tuna, two. Tuna, tuna, two. Tomatoes, two. And meat. Not just meat. Meatballs. And a safe. <laughs> Should go on top of the first aid kit. Makes all the sense. Yeah, we want to secure that. Still says remove. There. You know, if you paint dirt the color of the wall, they want you to remove. It won't be a mess anymore. The shelves. I guess this is probably going to be a living area kitchen. Keep that stuff. Come on. I want you to remove the shelves, but keep all the stuff on the shelves, right where it was. That's right. You've got it. Somehow. All right. Well. Cool. I feel like the people that own this house are probably therapists or doctors. Or they're planning on doing some sort of experiment with whoever they have down here. Mm hmm. But actually, hospitals tend not to have white walls. It's too stark, makes people feel not good. Like there's actually medical repercussions to having walls like this in a medical facility. I know, but that doesn't that doesn't mean some some doctors don't want it. Well, only dumb ones. 
No, only ones that want to tr torture their patients. I suppose that is an option. How ragey are you feeling, Brandon? I have to buy a whole can of paint for less than four panels. Yep. Dear God. <laughs> Modern kitchen sink. Modern kitchen cabinet with sink. Andy. With sink Andy. Obviously. All white. Obviously. It's clearly... Obviously what they want. It's their aesthetic. It's like they're trying to be minimalists, but like... But they think minimalism is just making everything white. Yeah. Yeah. Four burner gas stove. Four burner gas stove. <laughs> gas cylinder eight. White coat syndrome. <laughs> Wait, it said eight, didn't it? I guess not. Modern hanging cabinet, Andy. White, white. Soft shadow. What it said? Oh, sofa shadow. That's what it said. Okay, table slim. Okay. Chair engulf. Shelf up. I mean, that is what we're doing. Hanging shelves up. That is what we're doing. We, we wouldn't hang them down. Not this time. Not after the last incident. <laughs> okay, and... Oop. And... Dinner served. <laughs> and that's somebody's leftovers. <laughs> Hanging shelf up. Oh, I missed this. Yeah, Mel's not wrong. It's extravagant in a bunker. Four burners. Just have one burner. That is true. There we go. All done. Hooray! Complete. Out. I elbowed my knee. Well, you put your knee in front of my elbow. That... Okay, that's a job well done. Ugh. I'm glad to be back in co color. Yeah, it is nice to be in color. Yeah. What's the last job we have? Because we literally have one more and then this shit job that I'm not taking. Sauna. And property development. I can't speak English too well. I'm sorry for it. I bought raw big house some time ago. And everything here is to do. The most important problem is sauna leaks. Sauna is a very popular in my country. We won't hear. Can you do sauna in my house? Except wood except wood on sauna walls. Oh, okay. But he wants, he wants me to do his sauna. Sure. That shouldn't take too long. That should be the right amount of time. Okay, I assume this means... Round back. You would think so, wouldn't you? Uh, he wants me to redo his sauna. No, he wants me to do up his whole friggin' house. This job is literally the whole house. The whole house. Yep. My God. Well, we got a little bit of time. Well, this room only needs to be painted. Okay, paint 
with the colors gray and white. Wow, adventurous, aren't we? Well, I mean, at least it's not just white. I suppose there's that. Gray. There we go. Okay. Nope. And we don't we don't really have to clean this this place. So that's we nice. We have to clean it at all, actually. Yeah. That is a rare bonus. <laughs> Please fix up my sauna. Whole house needs to be done. <laughs> yeah, isn't that always the way? Um, no. Not in our experience thus far. Suppose you have a point. You know, in theory, you could do like all of the walls white and then like <laughs> one section. You know what? Gray. Sure. Why not? We're doing this. <laughs> You got something going on here, dude. Some sort of an art thing. <laughs> it's happening. It's what? <laughs> I did not. I did not. It's so art deco. <laughs> Hopefully he wants gray on some of his other walls, because for some reason, this white can was able to color this entire thing. <laughs> this house is so raw it hasn't gotten dirty with time yet. <laughs> Hashtag Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Damn, I should have used the gray in, in there because now I need white on the rest of the house. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just start by painting. This room needs white. Probably need two in here. This room needs white. Do one in there. This room needs nothing. So it needs tiles. No painting actually. It's tiling. Yeah. This one needs tiles panels actually this one paint with the colors silver glacier and white I'll probably have leftover white by then hopefully you know, I already put I one... would put a third one in the living room or one I right put one in here and then use leftovers yeah and this one is tiles tiles okay cool I really kind of wish that uh, the color of the wall that it started as wasn't so close to white. Mm -hmm. It's like drywall or something. Yeah, it's like plain drywall. Mm -hmm. It's like somebody bought a brand new house and they want me to set it up for homeowners. Yeah. Almost like that. It's almost like that. What I want to know is why the white on the wall doesn't match the white of the uh, door frame and doors. Because as we already determined, the people who made this game aren't exactly sense. competent at decorating and organization. They're clearly fine at coding and creating a game that 
it's reasonably fun because even with all the frustrations, I still keep coming back to it because it, it is enjoyable. Mm -hmm. There's just so many frustrations. Yeah. And as I say every time, it's just worse because there's so, there frustrations that could so easily be fixed. Right. They're such minor issues. But it is a fun game, so there's that. Yeah. The house is slowly turning into black and white. Like it's turning a color of gray that looks like it's reasonable from an old time cartoon or something. Oh yeah. Like it looks like we're back in an Bendy and the Ink Machine almost. Almost. But like without the sepia. <laughs> You know, for the longest time, I pronounced sepia as sepia. I think it's one of those potato-potato things. Probably, but sepia sounds more right. <laughs> IMO. Yeah, if you like. And also, I know nobody who actually calls potatoes potato. Oh yeah, because that's because it's wrong. Yeah. The only the only time anybody ever calls it potato is if they're wrong. Is if if they're wrong. Or if they're trying to make a comparison between two things that are both equally right. Right. Even though potato is clearly wrong. Yeah. It's like p uh, pizza schmizza. Yeah. Nobody calls it a schmizza. Uh, okay, this Except one for is empty. the company pizza schmizza. Uh, right, but that's a brand. Correct. Okay, is this a white brand? No. No. But I might... Paint it anyway, just out of completionist. Uh, okay, now this room needs to be white. White. Oh, we have carpet, as but it's like tiles. It's uh, weird. I'm sorry. What? Lay floor tiles, fitted carpet beige. Oh, I guess that makes sense. It wouldn't make sense for the game to throw in a whole new mechanic when they can just make carpet tiles and call it good. Yeah. So... By the way, uh -huh. you, you saw that new Star Wars teaser. I did. There is a ton of stuff going on, obviously. Yeah. Clearly C-3PO is the Sith Lord. Obviously. I thought R2 was. Uh, well, they're now, in cahoots. You, you saw the trailer, right? Yeah, I did. Okay, you saw the part where C-3PO is like on this metal contraption, his eyes are glowing red? Yeah. Clearly you did. Well, yeah, people are saying he's clearly the Sith Lord the whole time. He's been under our nose the whole time and we never noticed. Everyone thought it was Jar Jar, but no. But no. Okay. But no, no but. Also, of course, the thing most people are talking about is the scene where it shows uh... Palpatine. What? No. No. The fight. No. At the very end. Oh. You know what I'm talking about, obviously. It was prominently featured at the very end of the trailer, or the teaser. Trying to remember what happened after the, the fight with Ray and Kylo. I can tell you what happened. Okay. Someone looked down at her phone. No, I didn't. I was watching it. 
Okay. Well, it showed a clip of uh, Ray in like black robes with evil eyes oh, and a red lightsaber. Right. That whole thing. Yeah. That whole thing that everyone's been talking about. Uh, even though I mean, it's pretty clear if you look at the clip that there's a mirror around her. It, she's in that force cave that she was in the first, in the second movie. Mm -hmm. It's just a vision. I mean, that's obvious. It's right there in the clip. I don't know. So, a lot of people seem to have missed that. And I don't. I don't understand why. It's because like, they want their narrative to be right. Yeah, that does seem to be the way usually. But the part that I like a lot about it is uh, she finally had a double lightsaber. Mm hmm Everyone's been waiting for that. And it finally happened. Hooray. Okay, garage done. Kill mount devices later. Okay, lay tile, ceramic tiles, white on the floor. Ceramic floor. tile or ceramic tiles? Ceramic tiles, white. Ceramic tiles, white, yes. Got it. Ceramic tiles, white rectangles, and ceramic tiles, white for the walls. Tiles. Ceramic tiles, white rectangles. Is that what it said? Yeah. Ceramic tiles, white rectangles. Yep. And ceramic tiles, white. Oh, here we go again. These people also have a. Oh, I just realized how many rooms need tiles. White aesthetic. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta say, it's kind of weird that this guy was talking all a whole bunch about. A sauna? Oh, in my country, we we have we like saunas, yeah. and so I want a sauna. Yeah. But it really s seems like he's getting this house for ready for homeowners. Mm -hmm. Unless he's the homeowner, I guess. Like he bought a. He brought he bought a fixer upper, and we're fixing it upper. Or he bought a brand new house that I hadn't even painted, like a, oh, yeah. a, a raw, raw house, uncooked. Raw house. Raw, uncooked house. That's right. Hopefully he don't get salmonella. No, he's nowhere near the ocean. Huh. Actually, I guess they're freshwater fish, but shut up. <laughs> They go to the ocean to have babies. Yeah. That's true. I guess salmonella is an STD that you get from fucking fish. Um. No. That's not what it is. Totally is what it is. No. Okay. We need to mount the fish. Toilet. Toilet. Mountable toilet. We should use a special shower. And a mountable. There's no shower in this bathroom. Oh. This is the half bath. Oh. There's a sink over there, and that's it. Sink is one of the more annoying things to put together. Because some of the stuff is really fiddly. <clears throat> Like this one right here, I have to I have to click a little bit above it for it to work. I can't actually click on the the actual nut part. Okay, that room's done. Now this room, fitted carpet beige, like you were saying. Mm -hmm. Rugs, no. Panels and floor tiles. Fitted carpet beige. Okay, ceiling lamp birch. Ceiling lamp 
birch. Wow, that's ugly, but there you go. Single bed mal. Mal single bed. Yep. All the single ladies. What? Standard four doored wardrobe. Boom. Okay, standard desk. <laughs> but Mel, if you were, that would if you were single, that would be your be your bed. Oh, I'm so glad we're past the entirely white aesthetic now. Yeah, I'm trying to my well, one doesn't have an option, but I'm trying to pick stuff that's different. Yeah. Done. Okay. Lay floor tiles. Well, let me do this front area first. Floor panel pine. Oh, it's a wood floor. Nope, nope. Floor panels pine. Oof. That is bright. I'm not a fan of light wood like this, personally. Not for a floor. Uh-uh. Okay. the random screaming children outside. Again. Dang it. I was really hoping Yeah. that one of these would be fine as well. But oh well. This one is Ceramic Tiles Gray Square. Floor Tiles Ceramic Tiles Gray Square. Singular square. Ceramic Not tiles, plural. Tiles gray square. square. Ceramic tiles gray square. Good. Just making sure it actually did the percentage up. Yeah, the walls don't make it work very well, but that'll have to do. Okay. You're carrying the sledgehammer around like you're gonna wreck some shit. Actually, I need to. Didn't even notice, but yeah. There's shit that needs wrecking. There's walls that need modification. And the Extreme frame. modification. I mean, I don't think that's what they mean by extreme house makeover. Yeah. Ceramic tiles white. For the floor Ceramic or the wall? Ceramic tiles white for the wall. That's the floor. Floor. Floor tiles, ceramic tiles white. Okay. Okay. Here too. Floor tiles, ceramic, floor panel dark. Nope. What about in here? Brown. No. Okay. Well. Okay. Uh. Floor panel dark. Just dark. Not dark any color, just just dark. Dark. Uh, actually, I think it's yeah, panels. Uh, floor panels dark. There it is. OK. 
Okay, um, install package of panels. <laughs> package of panels. At least faster. It's still one at a time, but yeah, it's faster. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Do you have a cold? You just. Mal you just... said, I've got a package of panels right here. I really hope not. <laughs> If that's panels, you've got a problem. You should probably see someone. <laughs> he actually did see someone today. He was just talking about it. That's nice. Okay, last one. Okay. Okay, Sir Sauna Heater. He says there is actually a literal. So what? There is a a, li a literal package of panels downstairs because the complex that he moved into is so new it's not even finished yet. So, he literally does have a, pa a package of panels. That's awkward. Um, what? It's not my job to arrange them. And two corner sauna benches. expected this to look because that that's way too many for one little room <sighs> but I guess I can give it a better shot Does he expect I, miracles? Obviously. Yeah. That's probably what it is. Screaming children. Yeah, they do that. Yep. It's one of the worst things about children. The screaming? The children. Oh. Kids are fine as long as they're silent and absent. Um. Um. I. No. I'm going to go ahead and disagree with you there. You prefer them not to be absent? Well, when they exist, yes, I do prefer it that way. 
I guess I just have a lot more patience for kids than you do. Eh. My problem isn't exactly patience for kids. It's more close to patience for adults. Um, my problem with kids is usually the fact that adults react so strongly if you do anything that they at all disapprove of around their kids. Yeah. And that is annoying. Yeah. So basically I'm afraid to do anything around kids, and I get nervous about doing anything around a kid, and it just makes the whole situation tense and awkward and I don't enjoy it. Sure. Even if the parent is totally fine, there's still that just general sense of, I don't want to be here. I feel like this was a conversation on Reddit uh, recently. Wall tiles, two, uh, ceramic tiles, two shades of white, and, okay, let's just start with two shades of white. Because there was, there was a, there was a, uh, an ask, ask men, I think, about what, um, a lot, a lot of women tend to not think about that men are always are near constantly thinking about. Oh. And yeah. There, were, exactly. there were a lot. There were a lot of dads who were like, you know, it feels really weird going to the park with my kid. Because <laughs> apparently they get asked a lot by moms if like the kid that they're with is theirs. Yep. Yep. I mean, I've not experienced that, but I've heard of that. Yeah. Definitely. Like, that's just, that's just a thing. Dad can't go alone with his kids almost anywhere without being questioned. Mm-hmm. Because there is a rampant problem with sexism in this country, and it's not just directed at women. Correct. Although there are a lot of women... That in general, who want to take all of the, oh, poor me, credit. Well, of course. That's always, people love to be the victim. Mm-hmm. I'm all not about... Of, not of, like, actual physical stuff, but, like, the victim just playing the victim. Yeah, I'm, like, I, I get that, like, sometimes the attention can be good, but, like... And obviously there needs to be some kind of change, but it needs to be on both sides of the fence. It can't just be one or the other. Yeah. Like, women need to become more trusting of men, and men need to stop being dicks to women. Yeah, pretty much. It's a good way to sum it up, I suppose. And of course, it helps to recognize real problems. Like, okay, for example, here's a here's a great example, by the way. Um, what? Men need to stop being dicks. Truth. Oh, a little bit difficult, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, here's something that happened recently. It's a great example of what I'm gonna say. What I'm what I'm leading to here. Um. There's recently been, I, I recently had a discussion with somebody on my Facebook timeline about popular YouTuber and recent 100 million sub count hitter PewDiePie. Uh -huh. I'm sure you're familiar. Yep. Well, as you know, a lot of people have some uh, opinions about him. Right. For a variety of reasons, most of which are fabricated mm -hmm. or exaggerated. Right. Um, and I was having a discussion. Basically, I, I posted something like, uh, oh yeah, I posted their wedding video. Because mm -hmm. it was gorgeous, it was beautifully shot, and it was really, it's just a sweet thing. And, you know, they had their wedding, and uh, Peter Pan married his longtime girlfriend, Marcia, mm -hmm. like 14 years, maybe? Wow. Was it really that? I don't know. Maybe. At least eight years. It's, it's, they've been together a long time. Um, anyway, and uh, I thought it was a really sweet video, and it was number two trending, so I was like, oh, yay. So, you know, I posted it, and I was like, yay, congratulations, and all that, you know? Mm -hmm. And somebody basically said, 
how dare you promote somebody who's a Nazi. Uh, racist, Nazi, killed 50 people, all this stupid stuff. Um, but unfortunately, common, commonly believed stuff. Right. Really easy to argue against, but when everybody is arguing it at once, it's really hard to defend, you know, defend against everyone, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, especially once, once you've finished defending it to one person, the next person's like, yeah, but what about insert the exact thing you just finished arguing against? Mm -hmm. um, anyway, my point is, if you start calling out people like that, calling them racists, just because he did I mean, hardly anything. Certainly not worth that title mm -hmm. in general. It really waters down the term racist and makes and really empowers racists far more than it helps anyone. Well, yeah, because they're, they, look, they look at this one person wow, who's being... Wow, perfect amount of... Of things who's being Sorry. labeled as a racist and they're like oh they're just normal people they're just a normal person so if I do it it's not gonna be anything because this normal person's already being labeled as it yeah a little bit of that but I'm also talking like you know if uh, it, there's this thing like if you're gonna get labeled a racist by doing something that is Innocuous. is next to nothing. Mm -hmm. I mean, he did a couple of things that were definitely bad and shouldn't be condoned. Right. But I'm not talking about that specifically. I'm talking in general. If you do something and people yell racism at it when it was something fairly innocuous, mm -hmm. then it makes the people who do actual racist stuff go, oh, they'll call racism on anything. It doesn't matter. Yeah. And they won't actually... It, it, it That's what I meant. It loses all meaning. It, yeah. ma it makes the phrase lose all meaning. That's what I was getting at. Or trying to get at. I see. I just don't have the right words. Cool. Because words are hard. Cool. But in general, these kinds of these kinds of problems are not just one person. They're, they're not just like, especially if, in regards to feminism, it's not just a men's or women's issue. It's, it's, a, it's combined both. It's an issue with the whole society. Yeah. And both sides keep wanting to put it on the other, on the other side. Like, right. oh no, it's, this, is, this is a men's problem because men are the perpetrators of all this stuff. Right. Oh when, no, this is a women's problem because women need to learn to be less sensitive or yeah. whatever. Like, when it's both, like we I mean, need maybe to... not literally be less sensitive, but like, yeah, we, there, we it's need... an issue on both sides for sure. Yeah, we need to learn to work together to come up with a solution as opposed to putting blame on one side or the other. Yeah. How much is that noise coming through this recording? A lot, because Mal was saying that the children are certainly ch childrening. Yeah, is it like you can hear it, or is it like loud and over the top? Like, is 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 it gonna is it gonna be an issue if we leave the door open? Because <laughs> it's really hot. It's only hot because the door's been open all day. I always close it when I get home. For some reason, it still ends up being opened by my roommates. They don't seem to understand that letting in hot air is not a good thing. It's hard to hear us over them, apparently. Worth closing the door, then. We'll open it. It's not, not helping much, anyway. <sighs> we can close it when it's actually cooler outside than it is in here. Yeah. Credit where credit's due. Those kids are really adorable. If you say so. That should be better. Close the door, so hopefully yeah. they're not as well, loud. Well, it's certainly better for me. Yeah. What? 
Is it possible in like post processing to? Uh, I don't really post process these oh. anymore. Fair enough. I used to, mm -hmm. but it's way more effort, and uh, with how with how much we get back, it's not. What is this? Yeah, it's just it's not worth it um, to take that time. Yeah. Especially since I'm a full-time student and a full-time employee. Right. I don't have time. Right. So I just export straight from Twitch to YouTube. Yeah. Man, I really want if, one of these. <laughs> if, we, if we had like any viewers on YouTube, mm -hmm. like hardly, I might put more effort into it. Mm -hmm. But right now... Um, we get like zero views on average. Mm. Yeah, well, it's it's it was kind of always well, maybe not always. Ever since we started streaming, it was always just kind of a place to put our streams mm -hmm. more than it was a place to develop views anyway. Right. Like it's always been more just about doing it than it is about people watching it. Well, yeah, obviously. It's just. I, I don't really cons I don't really think about it, and then hear it, hearing about it, it's like oh. <laughs> yeah, I get that. We do get views every now and then. Yeah. Okay, now what the heck? That looks like another sink, but like. No, that's like a really weird shape. It's not a normal shape. I don't understand what that's supposed to be. Um, let's see, it's some mountable bathroom device. And um, a tub? Maybe? No, it seems a little tall to be a tub, doesn't it? Yeah. I feel like the tub installations would be in the floor. That's true. Uh, maybe not. That's true. Nope, that's it. It would snap it. I knew it would snap into place once it uh, went there. Yeah. And just first try, I got it. Okay. Okay, halogen lamp. Halogen lamp. Need four of them. Okay, one over that. One over that. One over that. And one over that. Two mirrors. Nice. It's better now that I can actually see. Mm. Uh, right. Okay, cool. Two mirrors. Cool. Chest of drawers, Mal. It really does like that. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to search Mal. Here's all the Mal stuff. There's a double bed. Wait, was there not a white option? There is. I thought you didn't like it being all white. I mean, it, it matches the rest of the aesthetic. Okay. <laughs> aesthetic! Hanging shelf up. Two of them. Metal trash bin. <laughs> uh, da, da. 
Uh, oh, I think it was Lauren. Yep. Yes. Okay, where does trash need to go? It's over here. I just feel like that's actually what this might be. Yeah. That's it. Bathroom done. Sauna done. Sauna bathroom done. <laughs> Oh. Okay, and then this room still needs to be done. Floor panel brown. Okay, floor panel brown. I'll have to... It. Okay, ceiling lamp tube. Tube. Yes, ceiling lamp tube. And oh, just one. Double bed elegance, I think. Nice. Is nice and elegant. I like the red. Is that? Mm hmm. Okay. Uh, matches the floor too much, but oh well, it's fine. Matches the floor in a good way. Yeah. Kind of. Chest of drawers, then. Then? T H E N? Oh, then. Yep. Mal will be happy to know. You're not using the mail this time. <laughs> Wardrobe Charles. Who's Charles and why are we putting his wardrobe in here? Somebody had to. Oh man, I finally got my my dr my dresser put in my in my closet, and it's so much it's so nice. So I have my dresser in my closet, and I have a little hanger rack thingy that I that I put my um my uniforms on for work. It's really nice. I'm quite pleased with it. Well, that's nice. Yeah, I have a walk-in closet. It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> a walk-in closet in an apartment, no less. <laughs> that is fancy. Yay. I'm super schmanchy. Brushy round trash bin. Brushy... Brushy round trash bin. And that's it. That room is done. Ceiling lamp cube for this one. Cube. Ceiling lamp cube. Put in the entry makes sense. Mm -hmm. Okay, Lauren metal trash bin. And these are separate rooms, yep. Okay, Lauren metal trash bin by the front door for some reason. Shoe cabinet with tree hanger. Huh, that's nice. Yeah. That's all it was. <coughs> Ceiling lamp triple. Ceiling lamp triple. Okay. Oh. Is that not what I got? Ceiling lamp.
triple. Guess I needed two. So for L. Okay. Armchair L. TV stand Anna. TV. Okay, I think it's time. I was trying to get some of the stuff out of the way. But now we got to start putting stuff in places. So if that's there, I want the couch like this, maybe. No, mm, that's too close to the door. Oh, that's going to be more like this. That's fine. Cutting the room. Yeah. That's nice. I like it. And mostly, I'm going to do a little like this. Tighten it a little bit. Okay. What are we going to ask? TV. TV. Boom. TV. Got it. <clears throat> Wardrobe Grenamo. It was right there on the top. There it is. Okay. Oh, that yeah, glass is good. Uh, wardrobe Grenamo. Wow, what the heck? I guess. Yeah. Sure. I believe. Oh, no, wait. This is all one room. Oh, okay, that'll work better. Yeah, Depends nice. on what they have you putting in the kitchen. Kitchen set with sink. With sink hex? Is this right? I don't know. Um, okay. Ugh. Granite, obviously. That's close enough to granite. There is granite. Oh. But it was lighter. Okay, granite, sure. Wait, nope, that's hex. Uh, let's do Andy. Uh, kitchen set with sink Andy. Here we go. Okay, whenever I can, I'm looking to get to do dark wood. Ooh, but not like that. I'll do cherry. Uh, details in dark cherry. Fine. Okay, cool. Whoa. It fits perfectly right over there. Yep. You know, it'd be nice if they organized the order that you placed items in somehow mm -hmm. to make it make sense. Because right now I've just got to kind of guess where things go until something pops into place. Good enough, whatever. I think it actually would. F no, maybe not. But it's fine. Round table auto. Fancy one. Gas plate. Gas plate. Steel cooker hood. Uh, 
or engulf. Pantheon Metal Trash Bin. Pantheon Metal Trash Bin. Set it on the table. <laughs> Good point. Uh, rug Yellow. Floor Rugs. Rug Yellow. Bam. Efficient design. Done. Da Two sauna lamps. I never finished in here because I got distracted. Apparently. Apparently. Okay, so two. So. Oh. Wait, is it supposed to be like this? I think so, yeah. Head lift. Head lift. Head lift. Okay. Head again. Okay, another one. A bucket with ladle. By the thing. Sand timer. Because we want to be super fancy, I guess. Obviously. It's wall mounted. Uh, first raise the door open like that, and like that. Bowl towel. That makes sense. And two of them. All tasks completed. We got twenty-one thousand dollars out of that, though. Yes. Yes, we did. We are rolling in the money. And you know what we should do, I think, to finish out this episode? Turn our garage into a sauna? No. <laughs> Though that's a great idea. We should make a sauna at some point. But no, I think to finish out this episode, we should just finish this episode. Okay. I was going to say we should sell the house. Then I remember we still got to do the garage and the, the mudroom. Yeah. So we still got to wait on that. But... Until then, thank you for joining us. This was a much... Okay, so that one house took almost an hour. Yeah. I thought it was going to be a quick job. I was like, oh, just a sauna room. It's fine. We can finish out the last 20 or 30 minutes with that. No. And then it turned into the whole house. Yep. Dear God. I was trying to go quick. But even then it took... For... Okay, well, thank you for putting up with that, guys. <laughs> that took a lot longer than I thought. Normally I don't like to do this game that long of a stream, but... Yeah, yeah. we'll be back in a little while. We're gonna order food and then come back with some Minecraft, right? Yeah, we're gonna Minecraft it up. Yeah. And we're gonna build our house in Minecraft. We're gonna do all sorts of good stuff, so we'll see you there. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Bye. Goodbye.